Hello, SOJC Dogs. After a cold and complex winter term, we are all excited that spring is finally here. Dove's Gift Day, the U of O's annual day of giving, is coming up on May 13. We will be using uh, this opportunity to launch the SOJC Internship Support Fund. Internships are crucial for providing the professional experience our students need to compete in today's tight job market. But not every student can afford to, to take an internship, especially those with financial need who must also work full time to pay for tuition, rent and food out of their own pockets. Our new fund will provide stipends of up to $2,000 to help SOJC students who need additional time and financial assistance to pursue a professional internship. You can help us give more SOJC students the chance to succeed by giving on Dogs Give Day. There is a link to our SOJC Dog Give webpage in this newsletter. And please keep an eye out for social media posts and emails in May. I am pleased also to announce the winners of the 2021 Ensel Payne Award for Ethics in Journalism, with, which honors inspiring journalists in the field who make difficult ethical decisions behind the scenes while making the truth known. This year's award went to the Anchorage Daily News and ProPublica local reporting network who partnered to publish Unheard, a collection of stories on sexual violence in Alaska using the victim's own words. These journalists empowered their subjects at every step and their work sets a new bar for respectful coverage of sexual abuse. We are especially excited to congratulate SJC literary nonfiction master's alum, Michelle Thoreau Woods, who is on the winning Anchorage Daily News team. I invite you to join us in honoring these exceptional journalists, as well as the 2020 Ensel Payne Award winners and the 2021 finalists. During our free virtual Payne Award talk and Q&A, on Thursday, April 29 at 4.30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Each, each group of journalists will tell the stories behind their publications and discuss the ethical decisions they made behind the scenes. You can find the re registration link in the newsletter as well. As our Payne Award winners demonstrate, we have a responsibility to do more than just deliver the facts. To truly serve our communities, we must listen to the voices that have been historically ignored, stand up against hate and violence, and call out inequality and injustice. My heart goes out to our Black community members who have been continually re-traumatized over the past few weeks by coverage of the Derek showing murder trial and the recent police killings of Dante Wright and Makia Bryant. Although the verdict in the showing trial was a step toward accountability, there is still far to go before our broken system is healed, as we must regain, remain vigilant in standing up to and speaking out against racism, and hate in all their forms. I hope you will all join me in condemning these hateful acts as we stand in solidarity with our community members from targeted populations. We must practice empathy and compassion and work together to make our communities safe for all members. Thank you for being part of our SJC community. Go dogs.